Peace, family. This is Lions Den with another news and commentary. This article comes from WLBT, um, NBC affiliate in um, in Mississippi. Um, we have a hostage situation that happened about 12 hours ago. Um, four people have confirmed dead in a Mississippi hostage standoff. The scene is now secure in the Clinton hostage standoff, which went on for almost 12 hours. Police confirmed that four people were killed during the standoff. They said the suspect has been taken into custody. No officers were injured in the standoff. Children were rescued from the home, from the home hours before the situation came to a close. Shots were fired early this morning. Saturday morning, a high active domestic hostage situation turned place, took place in the Clinton neighborhood of Huntcliffe. Fire, SWAT, and Clinton PD were on the scene. You see the pictures there when you have the SWAT team, the FBI, and Clinton PD was there when the incident happened. According to Clinton PIO, Martin Jones' family members were inside the house. He cannot confirm how many, were, how many there were. The incident started around 2.30 or 3 a.m. Saturday morning. This is a development story. We will provide more information when possible. So this is a tweet from Reggie Marion, WLBT, you know, confirming the hostage situation, which is a domestic situation in Clinton, um, Mississippi. There's a video now, uh, um, and again, um, Reaction will not play the video, but you will hear the audio of what's going on. So I'm gonna go ahead and play this, and then I'm gonna finish the rest of my commentary. Quiet Clinton neighborhood is now shattered after a deadly standoff. It went on for nearly 12 hours before a suspect was arrested. We now know that four people are dead. Howard Ballou is live in Clinton with more Howard. Well, Patrice, as Clinton residents try to process what happened in their community today, MBI is processing the scene of a horrifying crime to find out why. It starts at 2.30 Saturday morning when two Clinton police officers answer a domestic call on Fox Hill Drive, and that's when all hell breaks loose. When our officers arrived, they received fire from the suspect. The suspect then retreated into his home. Backup from a variety of law enforcement agencies, including the FBI, converge on the scene. Around 11 a.m., two children are rescued from the home as the standoff continues. There were two small children that were inside that residence for uh, several hours. They were released, and uh, they are safe and out of harm's way. Just before 3 p.m., after nearly 12 hours, the standoff ends when first responders subdue the suspect and make an arrest. Our cameras spotting this sniper-style rifle in the yard just across the street. The suspect was taken into custody without injury? The suspect was taken into custody. Officer involved shooting. With that being said, uh, the Mississippi Bureau of Investigation will now be conducting uh, interviews and gathering information along with the crime scene. A battering ram was used to get inside the house, officers discovering a gruesome scene, four people dead. This has been a real traumatic day here in this area of Clinton, and, and I want to thank the citizens of Fox Run. Nothing like this has ever happened before that I'm aware of in the city. Now, we still don't have the identities of those who were killed, and we're trying to confirm whether one of the four dead is the shooter. We don't have that confirmed just yet, but we'll stay on top of it. We do know no law enforcement officers were injured in this. We'll stay on top of it and keep you posted. I'm Howard Ballou, three on your side, live in Clinton. So there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Um, as you may know, um, we don't even know what the suspect looked like. We don't know the hostage's name, but uh, once I get more information about this, I will do an update on this. But to let you guys know what happened in Mississippi, that is another mass shooting that claimed the life of four people. Um, and as you can tell by the reporter that we don't know one of the, sh one of the person that was killed was the shooter. But again, there's been talk now that the shooter was taken into custody so the four people that was inside the house could be one of his you know ex-wife or ex-girlfriend we really don't know at this point 
But again, once I get more information, I will do an update on this story. But just to let you know what happened, um, just about well, it's about what happened early yesterday morning. There's been a standoff in in Clinton, Mississippi, that claimed the life of four people. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this. Share this video. Subscribe my YouTube channel. Subscribe my reaction channel. And subscribe my Black Junction channel for all the news and commentary. With that being said, this is Lion's Den signing off. Deuces.